doing this is Des um, I want to say I'm really excited today because this um, video that I'm doing is different from the ones that you've been seeing which have um, so far been talking about um, salads and salad dressing this that I'm doing now is actually the in stilettos part of the fit in stilettos if um, you've been watching my videos and if you have been to my website then you know that the name of my website is www.fitinstilettos.com and people have been wondering you know how did I come up with that name well it's because I'm passionate about health fitness and fashion specifically shoes so if you're thinking oh my gosh that is so many shoes yes I know but these are all my babies and shoes are just my passion and um, the video I'm doing today is especially dear to my heart because it is dedicated to Mother's Day. And um, first I want to say Happy Mother's Day to all the wonderful moms out there. And um, being a mom doesn't always have to mean that you actually give birth to a child. If you are a mother figure to somebody, if someone is like a mother to you, it could be a sister, it could be an aunt, it could be a neighbor, it could be a co-worker, it doesn't matter. As long as that person makes an impact in your life and you love them like you would your mom, as far as I'm concerned, that person deserves a happy Mother's Day today. And I know there's so many holidays, there's Valentine's Day, there's, you know, Columbus Day, there's Memorial Day and everything is, you know, centered on having to do something on that day. But I feel like Mother's Day is special because yes even though you should do something special for your loved one every day but we all get busy and you know you don't actually take the time sometimes to just stop and appreciate the important people in your life so um that's why mother's day is one of those days where it's you should make the mom in your life or if you're a mom yourself that's just a special day and um i'm a mom myself i have a wonderful beautiful smart son and he's four years old and he's just the light of my life and you know he's my everything and I feel like one of the, my greatest accomplishments is becoming a mom and I feel so proud and honored to be his mom you know he's such a great 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 kid I know every mom says that about that kid but about their kid but you know my kid is truly just truly special so um the reason why I'm doing this is because I love shoes and I like to incorporate shoes any way I can. And when I became a mom four years ago, I was excited, of course, for having a, a, a son and giving birth to a baby. But also I was like, oh my gosh, here we go. Another day where I can receive a gift. And we all like receiving gifts, okay? You may admit it or not, but we all like receiving gifts. I love my birthday, Christmas, um, valentine's day whatever day it is which me that means i'll be receiving a gift awesome because who doesn't like opening up a present like oh my gosh what is this you shouldn't have so um so i was excited about mother's day but my son you know he's he was a baby then and he's four now so now he kind of understands you know mother's day and gifts and all that stuff but you know what is he gonna do he's probably gonna make me a cute little card you know or I don't know maybe give me a big hug or something for Mother's Day which is really all that would mean so much to me so that's fine but I feel like as moms and as wives sometimes we put the pressure on our husbands to like I remember when I was first became a mom four years ago I told my husband okay it's Mother's Day so this is my day so you need to do this you need to do that I'm so excited or whatever and then for I stopped and thought to myself you know why am I putting so much pressure on him to make Mother's Day special for me? You know, his mom passed some years back, so this is, you know, a hard day for him. And I'm not his mom, even though I gave birth to his child and labored for 20 hours, by the way. You know, I'm just saying. But it's okay. You know, the joy of having a child is like nothing else. 
So I thought to myself, you know what? I'm gonna do something special for myself. I'm gonna try to do something, pamper myself on this special day. And what better way to pamper myself? Yes, you know, shoes. So that's how the Mother's Day shoe gift to myself started on that day, Mother's Day four years ago. And every year since then, when Mother's Day is around the corner, I get excited because I know I'm gonna go get a special pair of shoes. So this Mother's Day, I'm all dressed up, you know, ready to go. My husband and my son are gonna take me out to dinner. And I would like to show you the shoes that I bought for Mother's Day for myself. And I decided to show you now before I actually go out because by the time I go out and go eat and everything, this skirt might fit differently. So now that it's looking nice and cute, I'm gonna go ahead and do this. So the shoes that I bought for my Mother's Day gift is this beautiful pair of Nine West cage pumps. See how cute these are. These are four inch heels and they have this cute little glittery um, design on the top and they're pointy heel. And I wore these shoes out already because I wanted to be able to do, to actually talk about how they fit for this video. And they are so comfortable because the issue I have sometimes with this pointy toe um, shoes is that after a while they make themselves known but this shoe is not like that at all it is so comfortable considering that you know it's a pointy heel and it's a four inch heel so comfortable i felt like i was walking on um like a bed of pillows or something and actually i have to confess that the reason why i bought these shoes for mother's day for myself is because my sister actually had them on um a couple months ago actually no like last month she had them on to an event that we both um, went to and I saw them and they were so cute on her. And you know how it is with sisters. She had it, so I had to have it. <laughs> so I um, immediately went online and I purchased a pair knowing that this would be my Nine West shoe. So um, these are a size nine because I have big old both feet. I wear nine or nine and a half. Once in a while, if I'm lucky, I might be able to fit into eight and a half, but that's really pushing things. It's, you know, it's me trying to be in denial that I have huge feet. So um, I'm going to pair them with um, this red bodysuit and this um, gray, this is a pencil skirt, actually. It comes down to just a little bit below my knee. And this bodysuit I actually got from Good American. And I love the bodysuit because if they fit really well. And um, I didn't have to wear Spanx or anything because it like holds you in. And you know, ladies, we need Spanx sometimes. I know I do. But in this case, it really holds you in. So, you know, and this is what it looks like in the back. It has a bit of a dip in the back. And um, I had to wear a bra because I'm not blessed in this area. But if you lucky ladies are, then you don't need to wear a bra. It actually comes with the pasties for to hide your business in the front. So I'm gonna go ahead and try the shoes on and let you know, let you see how they fit. This down, move this here a bit. So I, I love shoes. Shoes are so beautiful, and contrary to what my husband would say, you can never have too many shoes because there are so many of them, different colors, different designs, different shapes, different heel heights that I feel that you can just never get your fill of all the shoes that's out there i'm sorry that i'm not looking at the camera right now i'm trying to get these i was debating whether i should have them on when i started the video or if i should put them on on the video and i decided why not give you guys a show of me wearing my shoes on camera you see how uh, all right, there we go. Why do we put ourselves through this, ladies? I don't know. Here I am, bent almost in half, trying to wear these. Okay. All right, there you go. They are on. Let me move these out of the way. All right. Move this chair out of the way so you can see. There you go. This is what it looks like. I hope you can see the whole thing. These are really cute. It goes really well with this outfit. 
I was planning on wearing a shorter skirt before I decided on this one, but I feel like this one is better. It goes better with this shoe. So here you go. This is the Nine West um, Cage Pumps. And the color, what does the color say here? These are natural. It says natural for the color, but um, it's kind of like a peach pink type hue on it. So it's um, it's the kind of shoe that will go with probably almost anything. It's very easy to pair. And um, yeah, it feels very comfortable. I don't feel like my toes all squished in in the front. And um, when I wore them the last time, I wore them all night for maybe three, four hours. And, you know, it was fine. I didn't even feel like I was wearing heels or wearing um, pointy toe shoes at all. All right, so this is it. I am off to go spend some time with my baby and my, um, my hubby. So um, I hope you like this video. And if you like videos like this, I have no issue. I can, um, I will um, do a review or just give my opinion on any shoe that you would like me to or any shoe that I have in my closet, no problem at all. That would just be like, you know, making my day if I could wear shoes and tell you how to fit. So um, thanks again for watching my video. Um, if you like the video, please um, give me thumbs up. Also subscribe to my video, please. And um, visit my website, www.fitinstilettos.com. Um, it actually has um, a Mother's Day um, post coming out for Mother's Day and it will be featuring these shoes. I'll talk more in detail on how they fit and everything. And I'll talk more about um, Mother's Day and how much she, how important it is to me and to all mothers out there. So um, thanks again for watching. More details on the shoes and the website information and everything on the bottom. And um, leave me some comments. And um, thanks for watching again. Happy Mother's Day. Oh, you can also follow me on Instagram um, at fit in stilettos. All right. Have a happy Mother's Day. Bye.